Hey guys, welcome back to the Clever TV studio. I'm Jocelyn Davis and today I'm so excited to be having a little girl chat time with Fifel Stewart. Hello. Thanks for coming by. Thank you. you know, I feel like I normally see you with your brother Boo Boo, who we love. We had him in the studio as yes. well today. Um, but it's fun to just chat with you too. Yeah. I like this. Thank you. This is really cool. <laughs> Now you also have tons going on. I see you on the red carpet all the time and you always have a different thing you're talking about. Um, first, I would love to talk about your music because yes. that's something you're really spending a lot of time on. Yeah, um, it's me and my brother and my older sister, Megan Stewart. He plays guitar and sing. I play piano and I sing. My older sister plays bass. Um, our music type is alternative rock, pop, electro. And um, we actually just went on tour with, well not just, but we've been on tour with Demi Lovato and Mitchell Muso and We'd love to do it again. Um, we actually might go to Japan soon. And uh, we have two concerts coming up, August 12th and 13th, to benefit Child Help. It's a charity. Um, it's a free concert as well. Love so, free stuff. Yeah. That's so cool, especially when it's great music. And yeah. get the fans would love the opportunity yeah, to see course. you guys. Thank live. you, yeah. Um, yeah. It's to benefit Child Help. It is a charity with um, that helps abused children. We're trying to stop uh, getting abused that's children great. and whatnot. So, that's awesome. uh, yeah. We um we actually just went to the village that they hold the children at. It's uh there's like a, a little zoo and there's a school and there's it's awesome. So. Wow! And so I'm assuming like anything that you guys do, like proceeds or whatever, would go and help to support that and raise yeah. awareness. Really, because mm -hmm. a lot of people of don't know what's going on out right. there. So cool. So who would you guys say? It sounds like you've worked with some awesome people tour wise. Um, who really inspires you music wise? I mean, we were just talking about it. Demi Lovato. Uh, She's just such a great singer, you know, like she has that voice where it like really catches your ear and it's just like, oh my gosh, like she's really good. So, I mean, being on tour with her was really fun and we'd love to do it again, as I said. Um, but yeah, it was, it was a really great time. It was just Chicago and I think it was actually one of our first bigger shows and we were just so excited. It was at Six Flags and it was just really, really like the vibe from so the audience. Fun. It was really Energetic. fun. Yeah. And I'm sure it's really interesting working with your siblings. I mean, I think about working with my siblings, what that would be like. And it's great because at the end of the day, you're still related. I you mean, know? yeah. Like, what's yeah. Like the energy like when you guys are working and creating together? I mean, we always have, all siblings do always have like that moment where it's yeah. like, I want to kill normal. you. It's totally <laughs> but, normal. Yeah. but I mean, we don't like fight. We always bigger, but because we're always like with each other. So we kind of yeah. have to get over it. You know what I mean? Like me and my brother, for instance, are always with each other like 24 mm seven -hmm. every day. Yeah. Um, but I mean, being on stage with them is is actually a lot more fun than you would think because you you always know that they have your back no matter what happens. Like if you don't know what to do, they're always there. And um, I don't know. Then you can go home and talk about it. And so it's I don't know. It's just really fun. So when you guys are creating songs, like what's the process like? Is there one of you that kind of takes the lead? Do you collaborate? Um, my brother usually does the melody because okay. he plays guitar mm -hmm. and drums and whatnot. And um, my dad and I usually do the lyrics, and then we just kind of put it together and mix a song. <laughs> very, very cool. Yeah. And something that I always like to see from stage performers mm -hmm. is what they're going to wear. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I'm totally a sucker yeah. for fashion. It's always kind of hard to figure out what you're going to wear, though. I know. Because you can't like pick out something that's going to fall off. Or <laughs> and it needs to kind of pack a punch as far right. as like sparkle or whatever. What yeah. do you like to wear when you're performing on um, stage? I kind of like to go a little more rocker, I guess. because. Mm -hmm. um, it's an alternative rock group. So, I mean, yeah, just boots or something would be cute. Not Nothing too girly, something you can dance in. Because I'm around. a dancer, yeah, I'm exactly. a dancer, so it's like, I can't just like wear like really big heels no, or something. sorry, so. no thank you. <laughs> so, I noticed that you're wearing tons of accessories. Yes. Which I love. Yeah. Um, what's your one must have accessory? Rings. Um, everywhere, I know you have yeah. one on almost every finger. Yeah, I everywhere it. I go. I mean, we just went to um, this place that they gave us. It's called, um, it's like, I promise. It's always uplifting. It's like, I promise to live, love, and laugh. I promise to like always be there. It's really great. And um, it was just, it was really fun. That is so cool. Yeah. And not only that, one of the other amazing things that you're doing is that you're very involved um, with animal related charities, the Humane mm -hmm. Society. Um, I know you support PETA as well. Yeah. Why are you gravitating towards these sorts of organizations? My brother and I went to the Genesis Awards two years ago, and um, I've always been the type of girl that loves animals and like loves helping them. And um, I watched their videos. And it was very sad. Yeah, it was very, very sad. Watch. Yeah, Genesis Awards was very hard on me. Um, but you know, it was a great life lesson for me, though, as well. You know, because like I didn't really realize what they 
were doing to the animals. So I was like, I think I want to try not to eat meat. Just see oh, how wow. it goes. And um, and I haven't eaten meat for two years now. I actually turned my sister into a pescatarian. She doesn't eat meat at all. And um, we eat fish. That's we eat fish. awesome. Yeah. Good for you. Yeah, I mean, I've, my, my parents were like, no, she's going she's gonna <laughs> to cheat. Like, this is never like with gonna Colby work. meat or she's, she's in like, and out. Or yeah, something. <laughs> yeah. But I didn't. I haven't. And so it's been actually, it's been really great. I mean, um, we just adopted a little puppy. Her oh. name's April. She's a rat terrier. Very cool. Yeah. Uh, actually, we just adopted her like this beginning of the year. And that's a Very great soon. route yeah. to go because there's a lot of animals mm -hmm. out there that need yeah. homes. Yeah. Um, is there anything specific that you have coming up with Humane Society or PETA or anything like that? I mean, it's nothing so specific, but just like every day, you know, just like yeah. helping out as much as I can. Like I always say, when I'm older, I want to adopt. I want to buy like two shelters of animals and just keep them. Start your own little doggy <laughs> ranch yeah. or something. Yeah, for, or just give them away to friends that know where they're going to be safe. But um, I don't know, PETA and Genesis and uh, everything just really helps out. You know, just like the little things you can do. Very just cool. helps a long way. I love how you guys are really using your fame, your celebrity to do something positive. I think Thank that you. it's not something you have to do, you know, it's not right. part of the job, right. but it's really awesome to yeah. see that you guys are doing yeah. that. I, I didn't know I can actually stop. I was like, geez, I love meat so much. I don't know if I can do it, but then like those videos really just like hit you hard. Hit me hard. Like, yeah. yeah. So it was, just, I love it now. Like it's so much easier and like, I don't know, just I feel healthier as well, you know? I don't know, it's Which nice. is definitely a yeah. perk. Well, thank you so much for coming <laughs> thank by. You. It's been so fun to have you some one-on-one -on -one time yes, with you. And of course, all of you guys out there watching Clever TV, make sure to stick with us around the clock. You can follow us over on Twitter, it's at Clever TV, to get all the latest on Fifel Stewart and her brother, Boo Boo, <laughs> and all of their many career endeavors. I'm Jocelyn Davis, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys. <laughs>